Every now and again, I see a video that makes me so angry just the way that somebody's respect for the handicapped is lacking. I have to call it out. Here it is. Welcome in everybody. This is an illegal handicap parking video and unfortunately it is out of Lee County here in Fort Myers, Florida, just south of me in my home state. And this person in a Mercedes decided to park in the worst possible way he could. And wait till you see what he ended up causing because of his parking job. This will make your blood boil. Look at this picture. Someone parked in the handicap loading zone at Mario's Meat Market in South Fort Myers, creating a major hassle for that local family. NBC2's Alex Howard is live in our studio. Alex, a lot of people are ticked off about this one. After hundreds of shares on social media, Steve Margnoli is... Margolin is ready to find out who this is. He says his family was barely able to get his son's wheelchair out of the van because of the Mercedes parked in the loading zone outside the restaurant. Um, we're in a gate trainer that um, helps him stand and hopefully one day walk. Parenting is tough. For Stephen and Jennifer Margolin, they have to be rock solid. He's a happy kid for what it is, um, but feeding daily. Um, you know, washing them, um, holding a toy. You know, we celebrate our small victories every single day. Ivan was born in 2013. Eight days after his birth, he suffered brain damage. He's also blind. He's confined to either a walker or wheelchair and requires 24-hour care. There's a lot. I mean, day to day. It's, it's, he's touch time every three hours. We have to make sure he's fed, clothes, bathed, brushes teeth. There's, I mean, he's very dependent. So you can imagine a family trip. On Thursday, Stephen decided to take the family to Mario's Meat Market in South Fort Myers. Backed up, came in, and I was like, well, this isn't a handicapped spot. Stephen called deputies to try and get the person ticketed, but they never showed. Social media isn't the only place where outrage is being shared. It's very wrong to park in a handicapped spot unless you have a handicapped sticker and are handicapped. Stop being lazy. Take the extra three steps. It's not only good for you, but it's better for us. Now, we did reach out to Mario's Italian meat market, who said they weren't aware that it happened. We've also worked to find the driver of that car. So far, we have not been successful. The typical fine for a first-time offender of illegally parking in a handicapped space without a placard is $250. Live in the, in the studio, Alex Howard, NBC2. Yeah, yikes. That is probably the worst uh, bout of parking that you could do. Uh, people don't realize, even if you're not in the handicapped spot, you should be smart enough to realize they need a ramp. That's how they get in and out of their vans or their cars or whatever it is, what have you. Those striped angled lines is where their ramp and their wheelchairs roll into. It's really not rocket science, guys and girls. It, I mean, you can see it here in the picture. So uh, it just so happens it was a Mercedes. Not all Mercedes drivers are terrible. I don't drive one, but not all of them are terrible. I have friends that drive them but a lot of them are and people with higher end cars tend to be a little more disrespectful or lazy it just goes with the, the territory i drive beam and uh, bmw not a mercedes but people give us a hard time too i would never do something like this not just because i make these videos just because it's not cool i mean look at this poor kid uh that has to you know find a way to get out of his van that his parents have because this idiot parked like that as always thanks for um being here on the channel. Thanks for hitting that like button, subscribing to the channel. Uh, hopefully you guys had a wonderful Memorial Day weekend and uh, I'll see you back here every day this week with new videos. Thank you guys.